Some say dance is communication on so many levels, and I agree. It is communication, for example, between the dancer and the art, between dancer, art, and audience, between the dancer and their bodies, music, rhythm, their environment, or between the dancer and the teacher or trainer. Communication is a behavior, and we cannot not communicate, as psychotherapist and scientist Paul Watzlawick has put it straightforwardly. But while dance is communication on so many levels, we might pay too little attention at times to communication in dance, especially mindful communication, and then again, perhaps especially in dance education and training. Communication is related to feedback, which is essential for learning and performing in dances. Not only when the teacher gives the feedback, but also when the dancers can learn to communicate intrinsically, perceiving their own feedback. However, it has to be learned how feedback should be given in order to be efficient. In science, several different ways of augmented or external feedback, the feedback that the teacher can give, as part of communication have been investigated. For feedback, for example, the timing matters, so when to give it to the dancers. Also other methods, how to give it. For example, which words to use, because words might create a focus of attention for the dancer to learn. And also the structure and the context, so which information to give and which better not, when a teacher aims to improve the dancer's performance. Communication is also related to emotional and social intelligence to perceived competence, self-confidence and self-esteem in a dancer. They are directly connected to their communication, as in the interaction, with their teachers and trainers. They will also decide how high the dancer's risk for injuries is, or how high their levels of performance are. Communication as a behaviour is a skill we all have to learn. It is an essential skill for teachers, trainers, masters or any significant other working with dancers. Communication skills are therefore also associated with leadership skills, as they are needed in teachers, trainers or everyone working with the dancers. Aside from giving feedback or communicating in any other way in dance and education, communication also matters with respect to management of conflicts. As the term mistake, not just in dance, the word conflict has a highly negative connotation in our understanding. However, conflicts happen all the time, between teachers and dancers, children and parents, partners and colleagues. We all have very unique brains, shaped through our very own experiences and subjective interpretation of the world and ourselves in this world. Being so unique, we also have our unique views of everything. Different opinions and conflicts thus are part of our daily lives. The question is just how we deal with them. Dancers or dancers and their teachers and trainers are working together for many hours. And when it comes to vocational or professional dance, then dance teachers or trainers really share a big part of their lives with dancers. Therefore, it matters that they learn how to communicate efficiently and then learn how to use different aspects of com communication, because different aspects of communication might facilitate constructive communication, for example, by applying different techniques, such as active listening, verbalizing or paraphrasing, changing perspectives, or basic skills of mindful communication and many other techniques waiting for those who want to enhance dancers' performance and prevent their injuries. By installing an empowering motivational climate, for example, based on professional feedback and evidence-based science of communications, dancers can be very, very much supported by their teachers. You are very welcome to join our lectures, discussion groups, in seminars on the topic and many others which are related to communication, such as feedback in praxis or motivational climate. My books can also serve you with a lot of in-depth knowledge in theory and practice, and I am very much looking forward to communicating with you.